everyone. Today we're going to learn all about pollination and we're going to make something along with, by learning with that. We're going to make flower cups. So let's get started. First, let's start off by talking about what is pollination. Pollination is when the bees start to come out and go into one flower and there's some stuff on it when it comes out. Do you know what it's called? It's called pollen. Pollen is a magical powder for flowers and many other flowers. So, when the bee goes into another flower, it sticks on the stigma and fruits or vegetables may come out. The stigma is very sticky so it so the pollen will stick on it. The process is called pollination. The magical thing in the whole wide world is pollination. Now let's see what are pollinators. The pollinators carry the pollen on their backs or on their head. It could be anywhere on their feet too. And they they carried it to the next flower. And it sticks on the sticky, sticky, icky stigma. That's right. So bees are something, wind is something, and butterflies are something. So there are lots of types of bugs that that contains which they like flowers and they go inside them and you know get a dusty pollen make flower cups we need plastic cups and to make it colorful i used um you know colored paper i used blue green and another blue We also need flower petals for this, but not real ones. We can make it out of paper. You just have to outline a piece of triangular, like these triangular long uh, petals like this. If you have an outliner, use that. We also need skewers. And we need cotton balls. So we need pipe cleaners. Now we're going to make flower cups. And I have my big friend over here. He's going to go inside the cup flowers we made. <laughs> and we also need a bee. Well, this is my wand for a costume, so I'm using it. And I'm making a joke. <laughs> we're going to start off with the flower petals. And we're going to stick them onto this. Well, you can use paper tape or just tape. I'm using regular tape. So, I got a piece of tape and a flower petal. So, I'm going to stick it over here like this. See? Ta-da! It's all ready. Now we're going to use cotton and we're going to put it in this. We're going to need a lot. We are all done. Now we're going to do the stigma with a pipe cleaner. So first you have to like fold it like this. Make sure it's correct. And now do it this way. And do some twists to make it stick. Like the sticky stigma does. <laughs> Doo -doo -doo. It's done now. Such an easy stigma with pipe cleaners. You can even... It's fluffy. <laughs> Just kidding, it's sticky. Okay, now we have to take some cotton out of here. Make a little hole. Boom. And now put it inside. Take cotton and put it in. Such an easy job. Doop. There. Now we're making pot. 
pollen grains. For this, you need a skewer, a sharp, sharp skewer. Be careful, it, it might get a cut in your finger. So ask an adult to help you with that part. First, you take the cotton ball and make it flat like this. Do, do, do. And then just place the skewer inside of it. And now take it up like this. It should probably look like this. And at the bottom, twist, twist, twist. So we're done with all our pollen grains and we made our beautiful, beautiful flowers and these, this is turmeric and this is coffee powder. We're using these two for pollen dust. Now I'm going to dip the pollen grain inside the turmeric. Do do do, scratch it, scratch it, do do do, rub it all around, do. <laughs> Ooh, the turmeric. Scrape it, scrape it, I am scraping the pollen dust everywhere, yay! It's like cotton candy right now. <laughs> Two cotton candies. I don't even like to eat cotton candy. Well, I love cotton candy, but I don't eat it. Make circles around, but we're not playing with the circles. We're going to put one more. Beep. 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 One flower cup is done. Now we're going to get on to the rest of them. Put it in here. There we go, around and around, do do do, around and around, circles, 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 all around, do 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 do. And here we go, the pollen. Now we're going to do coffee powder for the last one. Do 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 here we go, we got the coffee powder inside the drain, it goes. Inside we go, into the flower cup. We finished making our beautiful flower cups. Now I'm going to test it out with my wand be as I said in the beginning of this video. If you didn't hear that, you can rewind it to the start so you can see it again. So now the bee just came. Let's first let's get hydrated like the bees do. Buzz. And now the bee is searching for its drink and the drink name is you know what it is, or maybe you don't know, because it's called nectar. Nectar is a drink for bees. It's a juice that is inside somewhere in the pollen, I mean in the flower. Now the bee is going. this um, flower and now she's 
putting it on sticky stigma while she's collecting this. Here you go, Mr. Stigma, <laughs> the king of the flower, <laughs> giving you some food. <laughs> the other flower got pollen, so this will make a fruit. You see all the, the bee dropped all of the pollen. It spread it inside over here on the stigma, so that helps it make a fruit. Go out in the garden, capture what the bees are doing. Look inside the flower. S see the sticky stigma, see the pollen, see everything that's in there. You should never touch the bees, otherwise they'll stink you. Give big boo-boo. Do not touch. They're very serious. <laughs> They're very serious. They don't want you to touch them. Otherwise, they're scared of if you kill them. So that's why they teach you a lesson by, you know, doing that. So that's an important thing, mostly. You don't want to get hurt by that. Bye, everyone. See you soon. I hope you learned what is pollination. Pollination. Remember what is pollination? Pollination is the best thing in the world. It's a magical thing of the world. The magical thing in the whole